welcome back gamers lazy gamer here and let's play some more fallout new vegas yeah i in in between episodes jesse and i cleared out the inside we got f quite a bit of junk a few skill books and uh, some other stuff I am severely um, severely overloading so let's just jump some junk in this old this old uh, thing here and then E to exit. Right. You're going to see quite a change in there now. No more junk. Well, mostly no more junk. He wanted this but we can't take that yet because we need to I have the slats I need to finish cleaning I think I picked up stuff for this so I can take that I am ready let us clean this floor Abrax cleaner is so powerful some real powerful stuff Used Abrax cleaner, detergent, and mop to clean up the nasty floor. It takes a little hard work, but eventually the gooey stuff stuck to the floor cleans up nicely. You can tell Paul that the wood looks to be in pretty good shape for its age. Yeah. It's getting there. Also, we need the computer. Which is over here. So let's take it. Let's go and talk to Paul. Which is my uncle's name, believe it or not. But, uh, well, names are interchangeable, I guess. Hey, Paul. We were all amazed to hear that Doc pulled you through. Good to see you among the living. Was there something I can help you with? Yeah, broken computer is a okay and slats. Well, that's fantastic. Floor cleaned up pretty good, did it? That's good news. Sounds very sturdy for its age. I'll start working on that old terminal while you and Dean do something about those windows. Windows? Yes, they're all busted and let the weather in. Not to mention <coughs> all kind of critters. So, you and Dean are going to take them out and seal them up. That's what we need those wooden slats for. I found an old recipe for an old adobe mixture called Wonder Adobe. Should be tougher than a death claw's ass when it's all set up. Just need to collect a few ingredients and mix it up at a workbench. There's one up by the store if you need it, or you can use the one inside. I already have the sand for the mix out in what's left of the shed, but you'll have to scrounge up the Wonder Glue in the water. Wonder glue's around everywhere, and check down around by the spring for the water. Alrighty. Oh, it is, and don't worry. Dean's a fine carpenter, so you won't have any trouble as long as you can pour sand, water, and wonder glue into a bucket. Oh, yeah, along with the wonder adobe, there's a few tools you and Dean are going to need. Just gather up everything on this list and tell Dean so he can help you with the demo and carpentry. See you later. Uh huh. Yep. So there's some sand stuff up here. Adobe sand, obviously. And parts. We need some more of that. So it's good I saw that. More. You know, we need one more, and I know where to find one. Because there's not one more here, no. 
I know where to get to water. And we'll go and do that. We need some tools we need, oddly enough, we need. Tire iron. Oddly enough, Chet wouldn't have one probably now. Or it's random if he gets one or not. We would need a hammer, which I picked up somewhere. I actually have two hammers, so let's. And we need a sledgehammer. And I know where to find one. So let's go get it. Um, and we're gonna visit Doc. I have a book he might read to get some knowledge, so we will do that on our journey. Well, like I said, let's go and get the sledgehammer. It's not my thing, it's originally a weapon, but there's one sitting right there which is nice so hey doc we haven't actually or well I started here because so we didn't have to go through all that mess actually I used alternative start but I wanted to start in good springs I like the place but in game, in, in in video rather, we haven't actually talked to Doc, so let's go and talk to him. Actually, somewhere here I saw... There's a lot of stuff we can get here, actually. You mostly junk, but let's... Take it anyway. I know I saw or didn't I? I might have uh, been thinking about something else. Still. Look around. Even so. Corking beans could be useful. At least that's going to be useful later. So nice, so well, I thought I saw. Hold on. Hey, Doc. How are you holding up? Fine. Um, I don't need me medical supplies right now. Yeah, that you can do with that book. Sure, I can help you out. So let's see, I picked up some voice modulator. Install. Anything for my arms? Nope. Chest? Nope. Legs? Really? I thought I had more parts. What? At least I have one thing. Yes, I'm sure. Yeah, 
I thought I saw a part of a piece of wonder glue in here somewhere. I might misremember or yeah, I, I walked around and uh, did some mod cleaning. Mostly stuff that's modded gets um Actually, if I did, I probably picked it up, didn't I? Oh well. Well, one thing worked out then. Right, let's go and uh, find the water then. That would be over by the... Um, over by where we hunted before. So I shall simply, why I walked all the way around, I'm not sure, because it's over there. Uh, anyway, uh, I shall uh, meet you there. Let's see. Well, there are buckets. And why we can't pick those up and fill them with water from there is beyond me, but uh, no, I have to fill specific water buckets that are prepared for this sort of thing. And we have three, so that should be it. Seen any uh, seen any um, wonder glue around? Probably not. <laughs> I'll see you back at Good Springs again, yeah? Rather you now it's not that far away anyway. Never mind. Just been wandering around to uh, here. There's always that one piece of wonder glue which we can find right here. I shall. Well, I can go over there and do it, or our good friend Paul has has a thing inside. And with that, we should be ready to fix up the place. I'll be right with you, Dean. Let's see. Here we are. Mod bunch of meals. Oh, I can make that for um, melee weapons. Actually. Might be worth something to sell. Let's do that. Wonder Adobe. Let's make. Yep. Hey Dean, we have work to do. Looks like Paul's had you busy on another one of his harebrained projects. Can't tell you how many of those I've been on. Which is it this time? Um, tearing down windows, sealing up walls. Wonder Adobe? Huh. I'm just wondering if this is going to work. Guess we'll see. Now about I take that tire iron and hammer, and you keep the sledge to bust up the big stuff, huh? You get all the fun. Anyway, we can use these nails and tack up those wood slats as backing for the plaster. Hey, you want to race? Last one there's a rotten, um, rotten. Wait, I don't think that turned out just right. I can s race him and get there first, but uh, if I go inside first, he won't come in. 
for some reason. At least that usually happens for me, so... I'll let him win. Don't push me. Right. So we're gonna fill up all these, huh? Okay. Let's prepare... Our... Battleground. You ready for this? Hope so, because it's going to be a lot of work. I'm ready. What do we do? Sledgehammer window. Just pretend that window's the fella that shot you in the head and beat the shit out of it. It ought to be good to let out that built-up tension you got. Can't blame you too much for that, though. Let's get to work. Here we go. This is going to take a while. <laughs> Well, we don't have to actually see it, though. You and Dean, hell of a team. Um, Sledgehammer, Tire Iron, Wonder Adobe, Slats, Chalkboards, Cover More, Set up some... Temporary lights, yeah. It's dark in here. Times. Say, you're pretty handy with that sledgehammer. Not really. Walls turn out great, though. Yeah, that Wonder Adobe actually worked. Unbelievable. Might have to find some other uses for you later on. Paul should be real happy with these walls now. This place is sealed up almost as good as new. No critters, no dust. Real nice. That's a fine piece of work, my friend. Here's your tie iron back. And I don't need something it. Something you might be able to put to use sometime. I put these together with some old junk I had laying around. I'm heading back over to the shop for now. Oh, one other thing. Give Paul this note about the wiring in this place for me, will ya? Yeah. Fine. Um. We got our junk back. Great. Hmm. That works. Yeah, uh, we're pretty much done with the schoolhouse for now. Parts. Watch out for the damn geckos down by the source. And I've heard there's powder gangers down on the road below that. Damn menaces. We're all done. Damn fine job on those windows and walls. And Dean was able to get a look at the wiring too? Outstanding. I was really needing this assessment of the wiring so I can start designing the power system for it. I want it to be totally off the grid. But that'll take a while. Anyway, want to see what's next? I guess. Did you wonder what that old terminal was good for? Well, it turns out I found a program on an old holotape I bought. I was picking the program apart and I believe it came from one of those old vaults around here. Seems it'll interface with your pit boy and log what you're carrying in the inventory and sort it all out for you. It's called SIMS, or Computer Inventory Management System. But we don't have power, right? Yes, and we probably won't have the power on for a while. But there's still other things we need to do for this system to function. Besides that pit boy of yours and the terminal I'm fixing, we still need the storage containers it uses to stow your gear. I already have a few outside, you've probably seen them but there's more we need to complete the system's requirements. Here, I got it all written down for you on this note. Will you see how many of these you can find? Great. We're not done. <laughs> no, we're not. But we can move around some to find the stuff. So let's start. We need six lockers, three stuff, and... Uh, more stuff. I know where to get it, mostly. There would not be one. Oddly enough, they won't show up until 
that specific part of the mission is there you are one there are three or four in these um, abandoned houses I don't think there's one here though I never remember which houses they are I usually wander around for a bit there should be some more there's one there I know it's here somewhere it would be very sad if that did not turn out to be true but there you are. I also know that this is not what I'm not the one I'm looking for. Cubs. You know? I seem to remember What the hell is your problem? Cheyenne? seem to remember that you don't really count if I... Okay, that's useless. If I get you now... What the... There we go. Well, that went totally overboard. But I didn't actually have to do that. That will help, I guess. Get my guns up. <laughs> Lock pick to at least the first level. gangers are not gonna like me very much so I failed on that but I failed really what do people say on that I wonder Done this before. Howdy. Howdy. Bad. That's helpful. Welcome. Goodbye. Yep. I've never failed a quest before. I don't think Joe Cobb knew what hit him. I'm hoping you took him down for a good reason and not for fun. Sorry about that. Not in good springs, no. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even easy people. If you want yeah, we'll turn that over there. Oh. Until next. Um. Hi. I hope you didn't just bring a heap of trouble down on Good Springs by killing Joe Cobb like that. His friends might come looking for him, and I don't think they're gonna care who was involved in his death or not. Well, what's done is done. So, uh, what can I do for you? Uh, nothing, I'm fine. Be careful. I'm a bit upset about what I just did. But on camera, I can't really undo it now, can I? 